Welcome back to GTA Insights. Possible spoilers ahead. Watch out and take care. Some Grand Theft Auto fans are speculating that the trailer for the new GTA Online update teases the setting of GTA 6. Most rumors about the next Grand Theft Auto game seem to agree that Vice City, the series' fictional take on Miami, is either the primary location of the game or one of the major locations in it, with other cities and countries thrown around by various rumors like Carcer City, Liberty City, Brazil, Colombia, Cuba, and more. Vice City is the common thread though. Then there's another major split between rumors, with some saying the game takes place in the 80s while others saying the modern era. And then there are some rumors that say it takes place in both, with the prologue happening in the past and the rest of the game happening in modern times. All of that said, the aforementioned GTA Online trailer has some Grand Theft Auto fans looking back over the rumors mentioning the 1980s. On Twitter, the profile GTA 6 News and Leaks posted two Easter eggs related to the new DLC for GTA Online The Criminal Enterprises. The first Easter egg is in a scene in the DLC trailer where a character says, It's insane. It's like I'm back in 1981 inch. The second is a new poster added at MC Clubhouses with reference to Vice City and wrote, Apparently Rockstar added a new poster to the MC Clubhouses with Vice City reference. August 7th reveal? Take 2's August earnings call is on the 8th, Boko's Source 1 and March 30th 4chan rumors claim GTA 6 will be announced shortly after GTA O's July 26th summer update. As you'd expect, some fans took these Easter eggs as hints, in part because Rockstar Games is known for teasing future games with small Easter eggs, although these Easter eggs are typically less obvious than that. For now, take everything here as just complete speculation. While there's something to this speculation, there's also a very good chance there's nothing to this brief part of the trailer. What do you guys think? Is this real or just another fake leak? Leave your comment below and don't forget to subscribe for more GTA 6 news.